So in this tutorial I'll teach you how to uh, crochet an easy triangle. Uh, this is very easy to do and you can make it as big as you want uh, depending on what project. This is like the granny square. You can make it in a blanket, in a shawl, uh, in a pillow, multi uh, triangles together. So it's very nice pattern to use if you want to make an easy project. So we'll start without further ado. I'm using 4 millimeter crochet hook and a cotton yarn which I have. It's usually the feather uh, cotton yarn. I'll put the link in the description box or a similar one. Uh, as always, we'll make a slip knot. And I will chain two. One and two. And I will make two single crochet in the first chain from the hook. One, Oops. one single crochet and two single crochet. I will tighten my thread and then I'll chain one and turn. Now I have two uh, stitches. I'm gonna do one single crochet in the first stitch as chain one and two single crochet in the second stitch I'll chain one again and turn now I have three stitches so one single crochet in the first stitch as chain one again one single crochet in the next stitch and two single crochet in the last stitch chain one and again that's we're gonna what we're gonna do for the uh, whole work one single crochet in the first stitch one single crochet in the next stitches and two single crochet in the net in the last stitch so basically what you need to ret uh, retain from this pattern you chain one and one single crochet in the first stitch and you always have to do two single crochet at the last stitch so only at the last stitch you do the increase of two single crochet and then you continue the same until you obtain you do the same until you obtain the length or the width you want of your triangle it's as simple as that very easy to do triangle nothing complicated and you'll get a nice shape And this is the final result of the triangle. It looks the same like the gray one and it's very easy to achieve. Like we said, uh, we, start with, we start the row with a chain one and a single crochet in the same uh, stitch as the chain one. And then we finish every row with two single crochet in the last stitch. And this is what you obtain. So you can make as 
many projects and as versatile ones as you want, like I said, shawl, even a cardigan, many, many things. So I hope you like this easy and quick tutorial. Let me know what you think and if you have any questions, leave it in the comment section. The written pattern will be in the description box. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye.